Hello guys and welcome to my vlog. Please hit that like and subscribe button if you are new here and please click that notification button so you will be notified whenever I post a new video. And as you can see on my collection, they are all healthy. Now I'll be showing you there are no rottings, no pests, nothing at all. And here are some more of my collections. We will be talking about today on how we can water them effectively. We because will be talking I know today about you already know that on how we can water them effectively. Because I know you already know that if you overwater them, they will gonna die. Because these cactuses and succulents are more prone to root rot and rottings if they are exposed on wet soil for a long period of time. you can see look at all of them they are all very healthy and happy now let me show you this this is a moisture meter this is what I use this measures the moisture in the soil and it will show you the right time when you need to water them just take this bottom part on the soil and the hands on our meter will show you the exact moisture on the soil let's try it here just stick it right up on the soil like this and as you can see the hands of our meter will stop on the exact moisture of our soil and Let's test it out on another pot right here. Just stick it up on the soil. And as you can see, it measures it up. Let's measure this one also so you can see how it works now for cactuses we just need to measure each and every one of them before we water them up and if they are measured as one in our meter that's the right time when we need to water them up because cactuses don't need too much water because on their system or body they store up the water so it can Now, let me show you this cactus. As you can see, this cactus, as I turn it around, it is wrinkled. For others, they say that if their cactuses are wrinkled, you need to water them up. But now, I'll give you one good example for this cactus. Because if we overwater this cactus, it will surely die. Because cactuses don't want too much water on their system. I'll use this meter to show you why. This cactus has already been watered for a week now. And as you can see, 
it still has some moisture on the soil so we don't need to water it up for now and for this succulent the black prince let's measure this one it measures three but as you can see this black prince right here let me turn this around it has wrinkled leaves and it is a good sign for succulents to water them up so let's water this later and I'll show you how I water my succulents for us to know if they really need water or not that's why i use my moisture meter to test it and for cactuses i also do the same when i see them wrinkled up i test them with my moisture meter just to be sure because it is better to be safe than to be sorry because cactuses and succulents are more prone to root rot and rotting than any other plants that's why we need to now I have here my sprayer and let's water this succulent and before this video ends, I am once again thanking you all for watching my videos. And please do like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified whenever I post a new video. Because I have a lots of video coming right up. And I'll also post my soil mix the ones that I use on my cactus and succulents I only use one mix for them all so please watch it whenever my video comes up and you will be notified if you hit that notification bell alright guys so see you on my next video thank you once again and Bye-bye.